one mission one message one cassette and then a small blast i'm talking about the cassette from the first part of mission impossible the one he puts into the airplane seat back video unit then a video plus audio message plays at the end the message self destructs let's decode this as soon as the cassette is inserted into an authorized playback device its media output pins first make contact with the player and the cassette receives power supply the microcontroller inside gets activated and the first thing it does is send a signal to the security chip it checks whether the device is authorized or not once verification is complete the flash controller extracts binary data from the encrypted memory chip and sends it to the decoder the decoder converts the binary data into video frames and digital audio signals after this the dac chip converts the audio into analog form and the audio video message is sent out through the output pins making it audible and visible as soon as the message ends a signal is sent to the timer circuit and a 5 second timer starts as soon as the timer ends the timer circuit sends current to the nichrome heat coil which heats up rapidly and ignites the nearby nanothermite strips made from aluminum and iron oxide causing them to burn within nanoseconds and generate heat up to 2500 degrees celsius These strips are attached all around the memory chips and when they burn they completely destroy the chip components within just a few seconds. 